Do you want to smell like roses? Hey everyone, it's Princess Asura. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to smell like roses. You're going to smell amazing. You're going to smell amazing. It's not going to be those rose scents that um, smell like soap. Like rose water and ivy from Bath and Body Works. Not that. You're not going to smell like that. You're going to smell better than that with this routine. You're not going to smell like grass either. You're going to smell like that rose scented girl. Let's get this started. So we're starting off with the shower. Before I start with any rose scented product. This goes for any routine, even if it's not rose scented, if it's the vanilla scented, if it's strawberry scented, anything like that. Before I get into those scented soaps, I like to use the Dettol Antibacterial Bar Soap. I find that with this bar soap, the scent of the body wash actually sticks on my skin after I get out of the shower. It sticks on my skin way better. So, I like to go in with this body wash. Even if I'm not doing a scented routine, every shower I just use this Dettol um, bar soap because it makes me feel nice, squeaky, clean. I just feel great when I get out of the shower. I actually feel super clean. So, I recommend this bar soap. And if it's one of those days where you're exfoliating or if you like to use body scrubs, I recommend the Coconut Milk and Rose Body Scrub by Victoria's Secret. It smells amazing and it's gentle on your skin, which is great. It smells great, it's just great, okay? It's just great. Otherwise, you can just use exfoliating gloves with whatever rose scented body wash you're using. And then these are two options for rose scented body washes that I love. Of course you can use whatever rose scented body wash that you love, but these are two that I like to use. So we have the Victoria's Secret Coconut Milk and Rose Body Wash to match the scrub. Or we have the Dove Peony and Rose Oil and I love peony scents. And this is just great. I just love Dove body washes, so this is a nice one. And of course, still this one is good, but I will always prefer Dove over a lot of brands. So I'm just a Dove girl. So now you get out the shower, you dry off your skin. Now your skin's dry. What are you going to do next? I'll tell you what you're going to do next. You are going to use the one and only Whey Body Cream. This is in the scent Melrose Place. It's light scented. It absorbs quickly. It leaves your skin feeling smooth. It is pricey though. It is pricey, but I'd say it's worth it. And again, I think I mentioned that it's light scented, so if you don't like very heavy scented body creams or anything like that, then this is a good one. It's a good one. And then we have the Miss Dior Fresh Rose Body Oil. So this is an oil where you have to like spray it on to your body and it's not that moisturizing so it's kind of something that you would use if you want like a little, a little glow. On your skin and it has some shimmer in it as well so if you want some shimmer too and still keep that rose scent then this is a really nice product to add on and then for perfume we're gonna use our girl Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet we're gonna use our girl and with Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet you don't have to like you don't you don't have to spray a lot because it's going to be very strong. So 
just to tell you. And then of course, we want our hair to smell amazing too. So we have the Miss Dior Hair Mist just to spray in our hair so we smell amazing head to toe. Okay? And then if you want to add a fragrance mist on top of that, or if you just want to use a fragrance mist, you don't want to use all that expensive stuff. Um, you could just use a rose by Bath and Body Works. This smells amazing, but I like to pair it with my Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet because it just goes together. It just does. Otherwise, if you're not a fan of Miss Dior and you still want an expensive perfume that smells like roses, then we cannot forget about your Vero. Versace Bright Crystal. This is the big girl. Versace Bright Crystal. This is the first expensive fragrance that I had in my collection, so I'll never forget about her. Never. That's why I had to get the big girl version of her. Because she just, that girl, she just smells amazing. So this is another alternative you don't want to use Miss Dior. And of course we have the Versace Bright Crystal hair mist too. Of course, of course. And you can still use the Rose Bath and Body Works um, fragrance mist too with Versace Bright Crystal and you'll still smell amazing. They go together as well. And that is it. That is all. You're going to smell like roses like straight up roses you're gonna get them compliments from other rose scented girlies from everybody that thinks you just smell amazing you smell great you smell like flowers a flower a rose and that will do it so that's it for that routine thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video